What is going on, guys? Cowboy here, and we're ready to continue on in Fair and Keep. Um, so I did hop back to the menu real fast, put us back into online mode. Um, you know, I, honestly, I doubt I'll run into anyone just because we are playing pre-release and we are on a press build. But even with that being said, uh, because this is a obviously prime PvP area, I felt it would be good to just be online so that you know, in the event that. We do run into somebody, which would be awesome. I'm, you know, it's it's something that's possible, basically, is what I'm trying to get at. If it can happen, I wanna I want it to happen. That's just slug. So we're gonna go up this one first. Um, I don't remember exactly where my souls are at. I gotta practice against these guys. As long as I avoid their grab, they're not that bad, it seems. Okay, yes, you attack four times in a row now. We got that. Can you block this, bitch? No, you can't. Let's check inside this little room here first. Yes, there it is, the first flame. That was really ominous. Yup, and there's the door. One flame of entry has been lit. God, super ominous. Super creepy. So, based on that, I would say where I died is um, probably another one of the flames. Alright, so let's finish off this area with the first first flame real fast. Get the loot here. We'll make our way over towards the second rotten pine resin. Mmm, take it, bitch. I don't know why, it might just be a placebo effect, but I feel like I'm way more of a badass extinguished three flame. I feel like I'm way more of a badass when I don't have Ember up. Like when Ember's not up, I'm just like, brah, just running in and killing everyone and shit. And when Ember is up, I'm all like, oh, I'm so low, I have to run like a girl. A scared, frightened, young, timid girl. I'm not saying all girls run, but for playing gender stereotypes here. Whatever. Come at me, feminists. More purple moss. Can I? These sacks just like... Okay, I feel like one of them is just going to drop down right on my head. Rolling. Rolling. Rolling on the river. And I just got my greatsword. Twenty eight still. Shit, what? What do you mean I can't change equipment at this time? Fuck, 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 there it is. It's because I was in the middle of an attack animation. Watch 
a <coughs> just a graphical glitch on that lily pad. <clears throat> All right, I thought there was one like underneath me though. The double plunge. <laughs> Listen, I'll fight you assholes, but not fuck. <sighs> not gonna fight you down there where I can't move. things are fucking annoying. right around where I died, if memory serves. Oh no, this is the, uh... Oh, it's Estes Soup. Okay. There was the Estes Soup that I grabbed. From there, I think I was going this way. Um... No, I wasn't. After the Estes Soup, I went out toward... No, wait a minute here. Let me think. I know I didn't climb a ladder, but I'm thinking there might be a bonfire up here I can snag. Either a bonfire or a flame. And wherever I dropped all my souls at, that's back where the other, uh, that's where the flame is at, for sure. Yep, yeah, bonfire. Is that... Wolf? Sif? Old Wolf of Farron. Oh, man. Hell yeah. Badass covenant to join. Items. I don't know if I want to go all the way up here yet. I think I... Oh my god, the view, though. Can we just take a second to appreciate this? Like... Fuck that thing. <laughs> I'll come back for that later. <laughs> Took one second to be like, nope, not right now. No thanks. Not while I have 20,000 souls floating around somewhere. Plus, that looks like it's just a, a mini boss and then um, probably leads to some items. I don't think that's a progression path. Um, okay, so we got the bonfire. 
Being in this legion is going to be cool though too, because while we're here, you know, any anyone that's here, I should have a chance to invade. Twinkling. Um, this is obviously a fake door. Oh. No? Do I hit? Yes, you swing through them now. Okay. Dream catcher's ashes. That's more I can... Another thing I can give to the lady back at Firelink. Alright, and I have a unique advantage right now of being up here. So, while I'm up here, let's get some bearings. Um... So, I think the door was over there. There we go. One fire is there. One fire is there. One fire is there. That's where we start. Look at that. See how helpful I am, guys? Video is titled Three Flames, showing you exactly where to go. Um, so, this is... Let me get a better look at this one. I think that is probably the one. No. Well, maybe, because I did kind of roll that way. That path over there. Actually, I think I see a... I think I see a green tinge on the ground. I think that's my souls. I can get it from right there at that bridge. Have I really just located my souls using binoculars? I am now MLG Dark Souls player of the year. Using a high vantage point and a bonfire to positively ID where my souls are. They killed all the mushroom people! How dare you kill mushroom bros! I mean, those guys weren't really bros at all. They were kind of dicks, let's be honest. Oh, even the baby! They even killed the babies! Okay. Oh god, not a crab. Fuck you, dude. I'm not dealing with your shit, Mr. Crab. Thought I went over here. No, I did. That item's gone. Let me take a, uh, I know I said I play like a bitch when I have an ember, but let me get all my health back. Oh, bonfire right here, too. Nice. So from a progression standpoint, let's see if I'm supposed to get this, keep ruins, and then old wolf. Okay, so I was supposed to find this one first, but I was avoiding all the, uh, the ground stuff.
Quick item checks. No, that is not my souls. It's just a green pile on the ground. Two flames are out. But I can actually fast travel to this bonfire um, to get to that door after I get the last one. And the last one is back towards the start. Just because it was like, you know, it was just right back. Um, it was coming here or going up it. So that'll be a, a quick and easy trip. Um, so if my souls weren't at this one. Get that jumping shit out of here, dude. Jumping ones are a lot beefier and a lot harder than the rest. It's like the ones who are on all fours by default, they're not as threatening. And the ones that stand on hind legs as if they're already humanoid, those ones seem to be a greater threat. Um, so it's got to be the last one. The last one has got to be where my souls are at, because my souls were on a way up. I mean, if I don't find them, um, I'll just check the video. Um, this is really bad. They're here. This is where my souls are at, because I remember I said specifically... I don't have time for this guy. I'm getting the fuck out of here. And then I ran. And sure enough, I was right. Oh god, he's still chasing me. Don't matter, bitch. The last flame is down. And upon extinguishing the last flame, the doors to the abyss will keep open for a cowboy. And he continued on his journey to the Watchers of the Abyss. Or that's what I thought the game would say if it did say stuff like that. I smell a boss fight. Those things are fucking mean. I like how literally I ran past that fire before. Um, and he got killed. By dudes. Like I literally walked past the first flame I could light and got murdered. Alright, so with the three flames lit, uh, my only remaining question is this loot that we see right in front of us. So I was looking at that loot earlier, as you may remember, um, but it does not look like I access it from down below. It looks like I have to get elevated unless I can... Uh, not, not... Listen, man. No. 
cannot jump up there. Um, This is where I found the uh, sorcery scroll. All right. So at this point, I'm convinced you have to. They, they got. There has to be an access point from above somewhere. Um, you know, because otherwise I would have gotten the bottom. And it looks like you can kind of follow that path down, back into that area a little bit later. sucks because it's like I hate when I can see loot and it's like I can get that and the game's like nah just kidding yes there is stuff there no you cannot have it right now do not pass go do not collect your $200 sir this loot is for people who are farther than you and not for you but all right um so yeah we got the three flames um we can continue on now past the locked door I think before we do that um I think I want to go back to where the watchdog was and try and fight that giant beast thing. Um, you know, we got our, our souls recovered, so we can take our souls, get some levels, and then go and try and take that thing out. And um, you know, we'll see how it goes. And I'm pretty sure I got all the items here, with the exception of those two we saw floating there. I mean, between the the three leaps we've made around, three loops we've made around this place, I think that went pretty well. Um, so it worked out worked out quite nicely. And you think about the kind of the timing and progression of this area two episodes get it all uh so either way we're gonna go get our upgrades try and fight the big thing at the uh the wolf area and then following that we'll make our way past the big doors that just opened up